the baseboard trim in the powder room. And to do that, I will want to cut away this 45 degree reveal that I have uh, cut. And I cut that so that I can follow the profile of the uh, baseboard. And I want to cut it on an opposite angle so that I can fit it up tightly to the adjoining baseboard. To begin with, I'm just going to sorry, cut off the top little corner edge. Cutting with the coping saw isn't terribly difficult, but I find, and I don't think my technique is very good, it just takes a little while to get used to the feel of it. Get as close to that line as possible without damaging the face of the molding. back in a little bit here. I don't know if I can do anything to clean that up, but that's pretty good. Okay, let's see how snugly that fits. Let's assume that this is my board against the adjoining wall. Pretty nice. Just a very small amount that I'll have to fill with some caulk. Okay. 